Andrew, thought we'd give you an update. So this is it set up. The measurements at the moment are 21 at the tips here. So that's the thinnest part. I mean, some of it a bit thicker. And then at the center, not including the knot, we've got 32, that's about there and there. Um, question we want to ask was, we've got these knots in it and we were wondering if we keep meat around, them, around each knot, can we go in slightly here so that it can kind of bend in this area? Um, we also want to round a bit off this edge here because at the moment you see it's, it's a right angle. Um, we've obviously kept, if we did that, we would keep the, the heartwood in the center there but we would probably end up going all the way to the edge of the sapwood here, like on a longbow, um, sort of a, a rounded profile. Um, I, I've seen all the profiles on, on the internet and from what I saw, the crossbow is a bit different in that it's more of a rectangle rather than an oval. Um, so we're just gonna draw this for you now, just to see where we're at. Um, that line there is as far as we've got it, which is, what was that, two and, two and a half? Two and a half inches. And I think we, we, we said it went down to 220 pounds. So 240. Two, sorry, 240. So if you just do it to 220 now, yeah, yeah. we'll see. So we've taken a bit more off, so it'll probably be a bit more. Go for it. Right, you're at 200, uh, 220 there. Let me just mark that now, actually. That's 220. And I'll just show you the bending. Go for it, flex it a bit. Go back and forth. Back and forth. All right, that should give you an idea. Thanks, Andrew. I really appreciate your help on this.